Everyone is always going through a change in their life. But there are changes that are very visible. Meet me, Queen Desta, who was a solo traveler enjoying the world, to now being this caring, nurturing, beautiful wife to an amazing king. Well, no one well prepares you for this new journey. Not to mean that I'm now well prepared. I just want to take you through the journey of me being in acceptance, adventurous, ready to experience what this new stage of life has in store. For sure, we have to adjust in whatever ways that we are required to. And we also have to be open people to be ready to experience all that life has to offer. In all honesty, I'm excited for this new way of life that life has in store and I cannot wait to incorporate the things that I loved in my solo life into this beautiful new adventure that we are going to explore together. Sit around and let me take you through my little roller coaster of moving from being a single woman to a married wife here in Kenya. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is my first video after I became a wife and Thank you so much to everyone that has watched my content about uh, the dowry procedure, getting ready for the wedding, the wedding, let, let's just call it the wedding series, all the way to me getting married, all the way to the honeymoon that we like to call our mini honeymoon. And now we are back home to begin a new chapter of life, which has a lot of, I don't know, or we are figuring out just like any new stage, in life and I feel like I'm excited to take you with me on stages of my life that I'm able to carry you along with me you know like from a grown kind of changed Damaris Queen Desta from not the I and let's do as we please but with the respect of a behind the scenes we perspective if that makes sense i'm excited for this new chapter of my life and i can't wait to see what life has in store new things that i have adapted or taken up has to be i've been enjoying loving it i've been loving to cook but i've i've never been sure if i should con record this content and the only time i ever remember documenting my experience like in the kitchen and stuff like this was when my baby or my husband was teaching me how to bake, which was really amazing. And then, okay, I'm going to share that. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new, my name is Queen Desta. Today I am going to be cooking, 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 my husband. Yay, yay, I'm married. And I just saw one faulty thing. Anyway, we are going to be making cake for the first time. My baby is going to be teaching me how to bake. Because I've never baked before in my life. So you see, you're gonna be making cake. Enjoy. You don't know how good. Cake was during my wedding day. Mm. Asante sana. Mm. Karibu, baby. If you want more, there's more. Enjoy. Mm. Thank you. Thank How long can velvet cake last? Long. Okay. I think so. 
I have to say there has also been a degree of learning because you're combining like two cultures in terms of what we eat and uh, not just eating, way of doing life, way of doing life in terms of roles, responsibilities. But the major one that I have actually encountered has to be cooking and the food that we eat because that we do every other day, like every day we eat at least minimum twice a day or three times a day you know so that has been like one area that i'm like you know what i don't want to feed you with like just kenya and i have to learn how to incorporate like some cheese in my diets and my food stuff like this <sighs> i've been loving it and when i can't cook i have life hacks let's go explore nairobi places so that's also a fun thing that we've been doing calamari for breakfast he is having pineapple and mint and I love it so I'm excited for you guys this video is basically for you to have a feel and a taste of how I am adjusting into this new phase of my life one thing that I'm not done with mm, 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 mm. okay maybe let me show you oh, maybe I should show you these balloons <laughs> I've been having these balloons here for the longest I put them here when it was like a welcome into this house situation. Oh, and okay, this is not a house tour, I promise. But this is my holder for glasses. If you know, you know, like I ever did a video showing how I have different glasses and spectacles and found like this very cool location to put it. I love it. Anyway, as I was saying, I'm still not over. Oh, well, <laughs> I'm there's always a theory about deras and stuff like this. Maybe that we'll talk about in another video. But anyway, I've just seen I'm in a dera. Ah, ah. So, I have been loving. I've been loving to watch. Someone, nobody told me of how much I will like enjoy the content that will come out of the wedding. And so I think for me as a creator and even like to you who could be planning maybe something like getting married or wedding or celebration. One of the things that you should definitely, definitely uh, invest your money on is the, con the content, basically the photos and the videos that will come after because that's what remains. Yeah. So I'm still reminiscing on my wedding. I won't lie. And... and I've also been enjoying like giving you guys like editing the content because that feels like a more of reliving the moment. But one of my highlight has to be Ooh, on my wall. I am hanged like the celebrity that I am. <laughs> I love this photo. Anyway, uh, on this side, I've also maybe I should show you this. No, unnecessary things not for this vlog. But anyway, we are here. I love candles. Just in case you didn't know, I have like plenty of candles. These ones, my sweetheart brought me. When he was coming last, I had like so many. This is another one that I'm burning. Okay, this is not a video about candles, but I thought I should share. And also for me to remember one day when this passion finally goes, that I really did used to love candles, you know. Yeah, but this is what I wanted to show you. Ah, the photo album. You know how this thing was a big deal some time back? It was really a big deal. Oh, now I have like all my photos put together for the wedding. Amazing people. I had the best bridal team, which I feel like I didn't highlight that in the videos. Oh my God, they are all family. They were really there for me. This was nice. I'm not even here to show you like this, but like the photos in here. But I loved it. Ah, I love this. Ooh. Adjusting to this new life has been interesting. I'm keen to see what life has in store for us, especially even on the content world. I'd really, really love to know as a, as a viewer of Queen Desta, how... What are videos or what content would you love to see? Uh, and uh, in what way do you still want us to travel? Is that something that's still exciting you? You know, like, I'm keen to even know. You can contribute into these videos and I'll be keen to hear that. And I'm sorry I came to you with my, you know, waking up gear and stuff like this. Ha! The other thing that I wanted to say in the same form of adjustment I recently was watching a video. Let's sit down. I recently was, um, as a creator, I also watch some other YouTube videos, you know? And sometimes I feel so sad when, especially those people that upload like once a week, if they fail to upload a video. And one that I've really been enjoying is called Maju Diaries. It's a podcast. You can go check it, check them out. But I've really been, it's, it's Kenyans creating content about their experience in America uh and uh, 
they've, they've really been informing me in relation to like life and what I can expect, especially now that I'm in this journey of embracing American ways and American perspective like different ways of doing life like you know it makes sense for me to build up on my knowledge on that field not only from my husband but from like other people so i've really been enjoying their perspective and also because they are kenyans like you know they can give it from my perspective and i can know what to expect so they do they are very consistent yeah and this is not like even a shout out i'm just sharing uh recently there was a last day i switched out my account and it was it was in my like real page that has the notification on. And I was like on a Friday, how come they've not uploaded a video? I was like, I really want to hear what they have to say. And what is the topic that they came up with this week, you know? And for a second, I was like, oh my God, this is how my creators or the people that are big fans of my channel or the people are always looking forward to my new upload feel. I'm sorry, guys. This is like my big apologies for any time that I have failed to upload the content. So... I'm going to try my best to be as consistent as possible because I relate to that feeling, okay? Yeah, so let this content creation journey continue. I also have to say, I have a new channel called Desta Reacts that you can check out. That channel, I love talking about, about topics that I feel like I want to address and give my perspective and not necessarily Queen Dester, but like more of what do you think about this? What what are your opinions on this? Yeah, we are trying to hit a thousand subscribers. So if you go check it out, I know we will hit that one thousand subscribers by today. Anyway, let's see what this year has in store. It's so crazy that I'm still talking about the year, but yeah, it's, we are still in the first quarter of the year. Yes, I'm excited and I'm ready for all the surprises. I'm ready to hit some amazing goals on this new journey and i'm happy to take you with me especially on places that i'm able to take you along with me anyway let me give you a hint of some places that we've been going to eat out when i get tired of being a quote unquote a wife that cooks and be like hubby now treat me you know i have stopped being understanding wife i'm joking but like i'm, I'm making fun of this yeah anyway ah I just gotta give you like a b-roll then maybe as our next videos i'm gonna share like places because i've really explored a lot i'll share places that you can go with your loved ones or just hints here in kenya as well as also in ethiopia because in ethiopia I also did get to visit many places wow and this is how this vlog ended up being a chitty chatty i was just adjusting you into my life but i feel welcome into this new phase of my life yeah, and one question that I continue getting consistently is how is marriage life? Oof. It's interesting. Maybe we'll talk more about it in another video. I'm loving it. There's, I'm loving to be loved. This is big. Anyway, I'll talk to you in another one. For this one, let's say always, always remember to create time for that to recognize your soul. Until next time, bye for now. Mm -hmm.